Hello kids. Today we will learn about the Hindu Arabic system also called as the Indian system of numbering. Look at this table. It shows the periods, the places and the place values. The five digit numbers are placed in the ones and the thousands periods. The six and seven digit numbers are placed in the ones period, the thousands period and the lakhs period. According to the Indian place value system, the ones period consists of the places ones, tens and hundreds. The thousands period has two places, thousands and ten thousands. And the lakhs period also has two places, lakhs and ten lakhs. Now let us learn to read and write numbers using the Hindu Arabic system. We write the numbers in the standard form using commas and read them using the periods. Let us take an example to understand it in a better way. This is a seven digit number and is placed in the ones, the thousands and the lakhs periods. Remember kids, while inserting commas, we count the digits from the right to the left. So, we insert the first comma between the third and the fourth digit, that is, where the ones period ends and the thousands period starts. Next, a comma is inserted between the fifth and the sixth digit, that is, where the thousands period ends and the lakhs period starts. Look, we have got the standard form of the number, that is, 2, 3, comma, 6, 4, comma, 1, 5, 7. We read this number using four steps. Step 1. How many lakhs? The number has 23 lakhs. Step 2. How many thousands? The number has 64 thousands. Step 3. How many hundreds? The number has 100. And finally, Step 4. We read the last two digits, tens and ones, together, 57. So, we read this number as 23 lakh 64,000 157. Its number name is written like this. Let us try one more example. We write this number as 7, 0, 0, 3, 2, 2. We read this number as 7 lakh 322. Did you notice? Here we did not read the zeros, but we did write them to show the place value. Its number name is 7,322. Wow! It was so much fun learning with Miss Rosie.